I've gone out and I've got the MDF. They've cut it to size for me and um, so now each of the styrofoam sheets is 85 centimeters wide. So all up is 170 centimeters. This sheet is 1200, this sheet is 500, so again 1700. So um, I'll glue that together soon. What I want to show you for now is the MDF is by itself very flexible. Like that's very flexible, okay? But this way, there's absolutely no chance to be able to bend it this way um, because of the difference, like I said again, in height from here to here. Whereas the difference in height from here to here is only three millimeters. So this whole thing should be incredibly stiff and very light to boot. Okay, so far so good. The plastic is so that uh, the resin doesn't get stuck to the concrete. As I've found, it can be quite troublesome. Um, also, the two bits laid out together are now 1.7 times 3.2 and three millimeters thick. Then I will spread a very thin layer of resin on that and then the star from on top of that. Okay. What I'm doing here, is just spreading a nice thin film of resin over the board. And then I'll place the styrofoam down on top of that. I have about probably half an hour to do this. So it should be okay. Get that right up to the edges, which is why the plastic is very the plastic sheet is very important. Okay, so that's 360 degrees here. Uh, sorry, 360 grams. So I'll mix up some more. Okay, um, it's only taking me a few minutes to do this, and uh, it's taking about, uh, is it 500, no, 400 plus 770, about 800 grams of epoxy resin to do this, on one side anyway, so then, um, then we're going to Put the uh, styrofoam on top, and then go do this again on the styrofoam, and add another two sheets of uh, MDF on top of that. So that is finished. I got I got this thing because it's proven itself to be very very useful indeed. Okay, so what we've done so far is we've got the two boards of MDF, one which is 50 mil, the other one is 1200. Then spread resin all across it, about 800 grams of resin roughly. Then I put, we put one styrofoam board, which is uh, six, uh, sorry, 85 centimeters wide, so 850 mil, down, push down nicely. Put a bit of resin along the top part of the second one, lay it down, press them together. I just pushed it all down nicely. This is looking like an absolute dream so far. Next, I'm going to spread another, hopefully, 800 or something. Although it might be a bit more, I guess, because this surface is not as smooth as the wood. So, okay, I'm going to do another layer of resin on top of this, then another layer of, then the other MDF boards on top of that, and uh, then I'm just going to leave it to set, which should be overnight or something like that. Although it's pretty cold, so I might do it for a day or two extra. Alright, more resin. <clears throat> what we have ourselves here now is a rather delicious looking sandwich. MDF on the bottom, 3 mil, uh, 50 mil dense polystyrene foam, and then another 3 mil MDF board on top. 
it is all bonded with epoxy resin. And uh, I'd say in about I'll give this about two days given the climate and everything. And then we'll check how you know stiff and light and everything this is. Um, yeah, I'll actually put it on a scale. Why not? I'll measure it with a scale just to check the exact weight. So stay tuned for that. Yes. <laughs>